Hi, ladies and gentlemen, this is Miss Flood. I am going to walk you through how you can set up the lockdown browser for a quiz. So I assume that you've already created your quiz or create your quiz first if you haven't. From there, you're going to scroll down till you see lockdown browser on your left navigation bar. Select lockdown browser. And once you do that, you'll see a list of all the quizzes that you have created. I'm going to select this quiz right here, Crisis in Little Rock, and then select Settings. All right, so here's where you need to answer the questions. Yep, I want to require the Respondus Lockdown Browser. I'll come up with an access code for my students. So I'm going to create that one for my fourth block class. And then there are some advanced settings I can select, or I can just leave things the way that they are. One that might be useful, or a couple that may be useful, is, uh, for instance, uh, this one right here, allow access to a specific external domain. So let's say you have a copy of the Declaration of Independence that you want students to access while they are taking the quiz. You'd simply, you know, put that in, or they have eBooks and other things like that. Um, or let's say if you're running a math classroom and you want students to have access to a calculator. From there, you can simply go down and hit save and close. You don't have to change anything here. And you will notice in this list, Crisis in Little Rock, the lockdown browser is now required. So what that means when your students go into their quiz, they will receive a message that they need to select or enter the passcode that you put in and from there you're all ready to go so if you have any questions you'll let me know talk to you soon